The hull of the first FDI frigate, Amiral Rahner, D-660, was taken out of the dry dock on 10 November 2022. The PSIM, Panoramic Sensor and Intelligence Module, was fitted on the frigate the same day. For the record, Amiral Ronark was officially launched during a ceremony held on the 7th of November 2022. However, the event was a only partial launch. The covered construction dock where the first FDI frigate took shape was flooded. The hull of the first in-class ship was not taken out to the outfitting pier due to weather conditions. Photos shared on social media show that this critical phase was conducted three days after the ceremony. The information was confirmed by Naval Group, who shared additional pictures with us, see below. What's more, the PSIM was fitted on the same day, highlighting once again how quickly the shipbuilder is moving with this program. There are now three vessels outfitting in Lorient, two Gowine Corvettes for the UAE Navy and one FDI. One additional frigate, the Frist FDI HN for the Hellenic Navy, is taking shape in the dry dock. Her keel was laid last month. The PSIM, Panoramic Sensors and Intelligence Module, was developed by Naval Group, initially for the Gowine Corvette program. It brings increased operational performance and better control of costs and lead times. 1. The module includes almost all the sensor systems of the ship, in the case of the FDI, from top to bottom, Sea Fire Radar Arrays, IFF, Optronic Systems, Navigation Radars, UHF Communication Antennas, electronic warfare, such as the CESM Altes H antenna. 2. The module is produced independently from the hull and well ahead of the sea trials. It can be powered up, test or even used for training while on shore. Almost all the combat system of the frigate can be pre-integrated months before the launch of the ship.